How's it going, amazing people? If you're a gaming gear in the second episode with more, but let's just Zelda Tears of the Kingdom on the Nintendo Switch or walk into it. So last time, because um, we took on two of the other shrines so far in the uh, in the sky above. So we got we took on at least two other shrines. So the one that we're able to solve here is the um the one which we <laughs> with the one which we literally died because we were taking on the the sky die challenge. Well, to me, because we just took the uh, Sky Die Challenge first and then knock out the, uh, the first shrine, which we would be capable of getting to right now. And the first one, which we, which we already took, the, the second one, I mean. So the, the one is called the um, the Mayhem Shrine. That's what it's called. Because we're able to defeat the, um, the Flood Crystal 1 and bring the, uh, the Light Crystal back up to the uh, above the other surface when we go ahead and place it next to that sensor where we we able to unlock it is the, uh, the second shrine to the uh, the mayhem shrine so that leads to another of its uh, robbery blessing so we are going to head beneath the um the ground because um we need to get right after the, the great hyrule forest which is somewhere close beneath it and there was going to be one of its uh, chasm which, which which we won't be worried about so anyway uh, let's go ahead and journey underneath so, um, just to take a look at where we're going just now, so I think we need to be heading straight down this way. I think, yeah, well, let's go and move beneath it. So, we will take the dive. Alright, so we go skydiving, and just to keep in mind, because there won't be a geoglyph somewhere underneath the, in the Great Hyrule Force. Alright, so we go keep diving. Yeah, but we can tell that it's so foggy, we couldn't actually see where we're going. Okay, so what the heck just happened? Okay, so something about the um, the great Karat Forge is uh, all covered in fog. Um, okay, give me a sec. Okay, so we're here now. So um, I was able to to move up on foot instead of just um, finding a horse to ride on. So we're just gonna take stealth protection. Well, at least we're, we're taking stealth to the path to um to collect critters because those are sunset firefly we're collecting. Okay, so this trail starts here. So we start by this trail and go through this fog. Yeah, but it is getting kind of super foggy and all in every, in, in every way. So, so how do we do this? So we just go through, do we? But the same thing for Breath of the Wild, so we just stay clear of all of this, this fog. Uh, no, we're not ready to go use that yet. So we're back here in the Lost Woods, it's where we are. Okay, so it's the same from Breath of the Wild, so we were supposed to go and pick to choose to decide which path to go. And every time we get lost and then we we start back all over all over. Okay, so we're trying to figure out which path lead to. So could it be this way? Okay, this is strange. Okay, so okay, you guys. Um, here, here we are because we are going to do the combat to that later. I mean, the the lost word is kind of hard to to understand these things. I mean, all of it's a black fog. It's just uh, taking you all the way back to the beginning. So we are going to head to the uh, minish to the, the Minshi Wood Chasm. It's where we're going next. So we'll go ahead and dive through it. And we'll probably go ahead and place some giant bright blue seed everywhere. We'll, we'll go ahead and place only one. And then we start by paragliding to see where we're going. Okay, so now everything around you looks quite dark actually. So we were supposed to stay beneath the under depths because we, 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 we were tr trying to define this location to, to the, uh, the surface of where we go and reach to to Karak Forest. So we'll just stick a while to pick up whole, a whole bunch of stuff here. Okay, dang, I mean, this is one strange place I'm looking at here. So we can just throw that rock away. 
And we'll go ahead and pick up one of these poles. And looking to see what's um what's standing next to that tree. Okay, so we'll pick up here more of these muddled bud. And I sincerely hope we, we find some more zonites. Because both can be put in good use for for auto bear later in the future. Okay, so how in the, in the world do we... Oh yeah, you know what? I think we go in... Oh, how do we do this again? Um, How in the world do we throw an item exactly? Oh, right, right. You press R and then select with up stick. And then you start by throwing. Okay. Just want to make sure I don't get my memory right. Okay. So now moving on. So there are a lot of different types to see around here. So let's not start by building some some few things. So we got here is uh, several of these zone devices we can start making. So we we, we got here is this uh, homing car, the homing cart I mean. So uh, yeah, let's go and select those two together. So that is how we go make it. Uh, Riju, can you put that away, please? Cancel that. Okay, so we're going to take main control, and it's not starting, so what the heck just happened? Okay, well, too bad we don't have the fan. So... Can we use the... this steering wheel? Or something? Okay, hold on, um, let's find out. Okay, I think we need to go to Ultra Hand. So we're just going to Ultra Hand. Okay, you know, I don't think we have Stack It Neatly yet. And then we see what's going to happen. Okay, so we have not Stick It. So what? So it was supposed to move, so why move all over the place? Okay, so we attached these two together, what would happen? Not the steering stick, you fool. Don't unstick the steering stick. Okay, let's just put them back together. We want to get them much faster, so... Okay, so let's sit it next to this tree again. Hopefully the device don't fall off. I just really wish it holds still for me. Okay, can we stick it next to that tree over there, or... Okay, I just wanted this to stand it neatly. I don't want it to fall, I don't want it to fall off. Okay, I don't ask for a call. You know what, let's just attach it, these two together, so let's see what happens. Okay, I only got six left. Okay, and we, we start by turning this device around. Okay, so now let me go pick up the bomb flower. It may seem important for me. Alright, and we go start the video go up. But why is it turning... turning direction now? Okay, well, this thing won't start moving. 
Okay, can we do it now? Okay, this sucks. No, uh, let's just do the cart. Well, first off, we wanted to place the giant bright blue sea bear, and we just waste one bow. So let's get the, the mighty construct bow. So, um, let's see. So we do need to get an, another cart. So we only got three cards left. So we can continue to unstick this. So we're sticking like this. So we can unstick this. And attach the on the bottom piece to the side. Alright, so we're gonna stick this. Alright, um we will So technically we will stand this vehicle right about here. And we're gonna see how it works this time. Okay, perfect, perfect. So that's how we make a, a vehicle. Okay, so we're somewhere here in the Karat groove is where we are. So pick it up this, so we're able to pick up five of the, the pose. Okay, so we'll go this way. And continue picking up the remains. Okay, so that I'm aware of. Okay, Riju. Good call. We, we need that we, this lightning rage. Okay, so um, let's go get the. No, nah, I'm not gonna waste one of his light, like ice stone. But no, I got the fire chuji jelly. I'll go for fire chuji jelly. And what more can we confuse with? Okay, so we got the the mother bud. I right, can these guys be still? Can you let go I me? Mean. Okay, come. Can you hold still? These guys never hold still. Will you start coming any closer? I don't understand. I mean, these things won't leave me alone. Thank you, Nobo. I appreciate for the backup. No, just run. Just run. Okay, hold on. Now, let's get the fire fruit. I just wish this arrow don't miss. Okay, time for you all to die. Please die. For my fire fruit. Just die, please. You die and rest in peace. You die and rest in peace. You stay dead. Come on. Okay, very good teamwork. Oh my gosh! Why? I'm dead. Guys, help me! Can this these things die? How are they still falling at me? I'm already dead. Alright, give me a sec. Alright, so the bottom flower is the best way to go because I don't have time for this. I just wish both hand, Gan and Han die and never come back. Okay, so now this is the problem. So we got here is another Phantom Ganon coming right out of the underground. Okay, so it can swoop up to attack me now. Okay, so what we got the mana? So no, we'll go use the Soldier 4 blade if we want. Okay, so we're going to avoid every other his attacks. All right, come on, step up. Okay, this is not good, so it's time to eat. Okay, so we are running out of ingredients, so we're not going to waste so much, so much food and everything. But you know what? Now, what more do we got? Okay, but you know what we got here is uh, one of its uh, mighty salt grilled crab. We're granted three minutes and thirty seconds. 
And we will get one of the island soon. Ah, oh, come on, guy. Let's be a team here. Okay, so we'll go and punch him on you. Okay, so this guy did got lucky. No, uh, the the punch room isn't the answer. I think the 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 mother. No, the the mother butt is. No, w w let's just use mother butt instead. Okay, I can't possibly keep stop swinging because I can't even release my natural. I can't unrelease it, but. I don't know, I mean, it felt so embarrassing to see Link get knocked out like that. Okay, so what is he doing? So that looks kind of scary. Okay, so can we please get some more Flurry Rush? I need another Flurry Rush, can I time this right? Come on, Link, get the Flurry Rush. Oh my god, this is not good. Okay, so just two swings and then we move out. Okay, deal worse. Yeah, that's that's how you do it. Okay. I was going to time with that Flurry Rush, but nothing's happening to me yet. Okay, get away, get away. Dude, I said get away. How are you not hearing things? He always starts attacking you. By no good reason. Alright, we'll, we'll just keep eating. It's halfway dead now. Thank you. About time we got Flurry Rush. <laughs> Alright, I want to see that Phantom suffer and die. Okay, so um, let's make sure that we not miss anything. So, okay, we already got the Demon King bow already. And it dropped more of these uh, Dark Clumps. Alright, and we'll definitely be needing a Demon King bow if we wanted to. Okay, so hold on. So that's a new weapon. So that's a Gloom Sword. Alright, so we'll go pick that up. So this is, so uh, this uh, gloom sword had quite unique mechanic to it. So uh, we we could probably pick this up. So this a uh, slender sword that has an uh, ominous of presence. It is said to the end of the life of anyone who touched it. A gloom will gradually wear down for the body of its wielder. Interesting. All right. Well, at least we don't have enough room. So let's uh, get rid of some weapon that we don't quite need along the way. Okay, so what do we not need? Yeah, we got so many, so many choices. Okay, you know what? Um, let's destroy this weapon. Can we? Yeah, it seems like that we did fuse so many soldier free reapers. With this weapon. So let's uh, destroy this. So that's some magic rod we made. So yeah. Let's um. So hold on. So we can drop. Can we still drop this? Okay. So I need to drop this weapon first. And then go pick up the gloom sword. So there you see. We got able to, to pick up here the gloom sword. Which had 41. And sure, why not? We can stick with the Soldier 4 Blade. Let's equip that. And then we can get a move on. Alright, so we can still continue on exploring and pick up more of these poles. So we are picking up here, it's uh, a whole lot of poles and everything. And that up there, way up above that tree, was a, a large one. And still don't see where we park our, our cart at. Which is quite hard to find. Okay, there was so much of this uh, brutal mess going on around here. So, 
so let's uh, go get up here. So we'll, we'll start by climbing up this tree. Alright, so we go tree climbing. And then we start by climbing this next tree above it. Okay, so we're able to get more by five. Okay, so we can study on test here. So let's find ourselves. Oh, yeah, so we were supposed to find this light route. That's what we're trying to find. So we need to define the light route to enter to. To define the necessity to go up to Karat Forest. So that way we don't have to go in and do all of this, uh, this fog puzzle work. Alright, so we keep going this way. We pick up one of these Poe. And yeah, so my attack up is about to the one off. So there we can see, we got very, this uh, creepy old tree from, uh, from Breath of the Wild, which we did saw before. Okay, so um, let's make sure that we light the way. So uh, where do we place the, the bright bloom seed at? Okay, so we go scrolling to mature to see where we put it at. Okay, so it's right there. Okay, you know, but out of the way. Alright, so we go light the way. So we keep lighting everything up. Alright, so we go this way. Alright, so we start by rock climbing up this way. Above this trail. So I can't even pronounce the um the first word it's best say um, all I'm seeing is a knap up. Okay, so just to take a look at where we are just now. Okay, so we're somewhere around here surrounded by darkness. Darkness, that's why how I say it. Okay, so going over with material, so we need to heal up. So we are kind of low, uh, low out of, um, well, we are a lot of food, that's for sure. Okay, um, yeah, let's go ahead and eat something. And we'll go for the bright eye crab, and we should be all set. Okay, so just take a look at where we're going now, so we're able to light the way. And still, um, we're, we're trying to, to figure out which path to lead to. Okay, we got here, it's a whole lot of these strange directions. And it's hard to decide which path to choose from. So, the, I got a little bit of this uh, yellow stamina bar, which is already finished, used. And uh, we can have more fun with this, so we'll go ahead and be at one of those Lazafos if we like. Alright, so we're gonna beat you up. Okay, no, you get knocked out. So I'll go and knock you down. Alright, so can these guys hold still? Okay, so this key is messing with me. So yeah, so you take the, the, the defeat while I collect that zone knight. Okay, so we wanted we wanted to keep it coming because we had to to get as many zones as possible. So what the? Okay, don't see where Mr. Lazalfo getting bow and arrow for. Can you stop sh shooting at me? Whoever doing that? Okay, someone in front rocks at me. No! Stop it! Okay, so we need to, to get up there. One way or another. Okay, so you hold still and let me kill you. Alright, so hold on. Now, we, we do need to destroy this. So we'll get more of these Zonites. 
So we'll keep picking up everything. So we got more but 20. Okay, so uh, I can barely see a a Lizafo over there. So I see the one of my guys helping out. Alright, good job team. Good job, good effort. Okay, so we'll keep picking up everything what they, they left on the ground. So I can't pick up more weapons. Because I'm all out. Okay, so I did already place a, a green pin somewhere further up down here. Somewhere at the west. Okay, so we'll probably head there. So that's fine. I mean, I could just keep uh, a half that I have a broken heart split in half. Okay, so we go this way. And we still gotta keep lighting the way. So, let's uh, pick up the uh, giant bright bloom seed and light the way. So, we just want to know where we are just now. So now we got here is something more that we can tuck under. So we go and tuck underneath. And then we figure out which path leads to. So we'll go use bow and arrow for this. To light the way. And we are detecting because there are going to be some more few enemies to, to clear. So we got here is the Bokoblin now. Okay, I'll go take it down with the direct shot. Okay, so it didn't... It didn't take um, the direct KO. Okay, so let's go take out the um, the boss Bokoblin, the big boss Bokoblin. Okay, so the Soda 4 blade did took damage, I'm afraid. Well, not to worry, I mean, we do got another Soda 4 Reap, the uh, Soda 4 blade with the Soda, the Soda 4 Reaper. Okay, seriously? Okay, it's not the only one taking damage. Okay, so we got the red cheesy jelly. Let's go use that. Yeah, because that's the only way we start by exploring things. So it did miss the smash opportunity. Okay, so we keep picking up everything. Um, okay. So uh, let's get the boiler breaker. And we'll start by breaking everything. Alright, so we do need to get some more zonites right out of them. Okay, so we have more of 47. So I want the rest of you guys to, to help out. Okay, you know what? Um, I don't see none of you guys putting any effort. So you know what? I'm going to go for the dust claymore. See how much damage will that do. Okay, but it doesn't build up enough kicks to it. But you know what? Let's do fuse to it. Okay, so what can we fuse for the dust claymore? Let's let's find out. Okay, so we keep on scrolling. But you no, know, we can go fuse for the black Lizalfa horn. Okay, don't attack me. Can you attack someone else? Jeez, you annoying beast. Well, it's going to get it. It better not go finish me off, I swear, if it finishes me off. I got three hearts left. Okay, that's it. So, no more distractions. So, wait a minute. Are those creatures new? Hold on, we need to, we need to light the way. Are these things new? Oh, those are the little frogs, guys. We won't be worried about. Okay, so hold on. Are oh, they trying to eat the, uh, yeah, they're trying to eat the bright blue seed. The giant bright blue seed, of course. So, that, so every time that they, they that they eat the, the, the giant bright blue seed, then we, we can't, it, it, the, the bright blue seed is going to be gone, and we can't see the way. 
Okay, so we got so much construction to go around here. Okay, so you know what? Let's start by building another plane right out of it. So we got the fans. So we'll get the fans and place it on top of here. We'll, we'll place the top of this. And the next fan. So we will place it right about here. And we'll go get the the steering stick. And place them right on top of here. So let's see how this is gonna work. Okay, well there's no point of starting it up. So So how about we do this? Um, okay, you know what? I don't think that's gonna work. So, is there another fan anywhere? Um, okay, so there were no fan. So, what are these? Oh, yeah, I remember. Those were bombs. And I do not have another extra fan on me. Okay, we need something for the plane to take off. Okay, this machine doesn't want to start. Okay, you know what? Um, let's see what we got. Okay, but I still got the car. I only got three for each. So, we can sell it right next to this cart and find out. Okay, that'll work. I'll take it. Okay, so let's make sure that we get some more... We, we get more of this uh, recharge for the zone I charge. Okay, so that's the only way we have more gauge. And yes, the light route is right over there. So let's get off from that real quick. Okay, so we do need to restore some HP. So, so yeah, so we just wait until it fully recovers. Okay, I think we're, we're good. We're good to go. Alright, so let's go eat up something. So uh, we got here at the Rage Shroom. So we'll go eat the Rage Shroom if we must. All right, so we go have all of that Rage Shroom up, and then we start by taking them off again. And figure out where we need to go next. So I, yeah, so I think we were supposed to... Well, actually, hold on. Let's make sure we, we face this plane further to the left. And then we start taking them off with it. All right, and there are going to be some obstacles which we need to avoid, so... So yeah, so let's get back with the with the zone I charge. Alright, so we keep taking off with it. Alright, keep going. So we're getting somewhere, we're getting somewhere. So we need to go to this next light route, which is right over there. It was right around that corner. I right, keep going. Okay, so we are going to start crashing, are we? Pretty sure we are. So we're going to have to abandon this device. So we'll go light the way. Okay, so we go skip. And figure out where we are just now. Okay, so we just, we, we just go and reveal this whole darkness of where we are. Alright, so we can keep flying. 
And just to figure out what we are just now, so we won't pay any close attention with the Bacoblin right now. Okay, so I can barely see another light route in the background. There was going to be another light route there. Okay, wait, what? Okay, how very odd. So I got no plane. Alright, well, give me a second. Okay, you guys, so um, I want to go do an edit and split for you guys. So um, I think this is the uh, light route where we need to go. I think, yeah, so... I'm able to, to get here is this um, light route which is called the, the Shi I am not, I'm not entirely sure I'm saying that. I'm, I'm saying Shi uh, I'm not sure. Oh, okay, so this is the, the first light route I'm able to go activate it. But uh, yeah, so we are reaching out close, so we have to reach out above the height to, to the uh, Karat Groove beneath the, uh, the Chasm. Yeah, because everything in Tears of the, t of the Kingdom turns out all different. We are getting kind of newer. Well, some are getting easier, but some are getting harder. And we, we don't, I mean, we, we couldn't actually plan on running into Matter Koga just yet. I mean, Matter Koga is somewhere near at the end game. Okay, can we stop powering up everything? I'm trying to pick up the pole because I don't want to be distracted by East Heroes avatars. Okay, so uh, let's let's move up close. So let's go and activate this light route. All right, so we're going to examine this. So we go skip. So that is our fourth light route. Okay, so we got all three of the light routes. And now we, yeah, well, technically I I did lose three of my hearts, which is fine. Okay, so. Now, the best goal is that we go do the Ascend. So we go and Ascend up this way. So we see where that leads to. So it had to lead to Karat Forest. Let's hope so. Because dang, that's a long, long way up there. That's a long way up to Karat Forest. Okay, so... I believe we're here now. So we're nearly here at Karat Forest, just now. Okay, so everything started to freeze. So what just happened? Oh, oh, it was the Deku Tree. That's his name. Okay, so uh, we go talk to these guys. Okay, so these little Karat guys got nothing to say. So we do realize that the Master Sword is no longer here anymore. Okay, so let's go do the shrine. Alright, so we're going to examine this. Alright, and let's go tuck in through. Alright, see how we, we knock our sauce off to beat one of the shrine, alright? Now, the Deku tree is uh, not feeling well of himself just now. Okay, so we are about to solve more obstacles in the shrine. So, there's a swing to hit. Okay, we, so what? We swing and then we hit? Makes sense. Okay, so what are we doing with this balance board over here? And there's a, a racking ball and a chainsaw attached to it. Okay, so we move it like this. And then the next one. I don't really care about the, uh, the racking ball right now, but... I mean, yeah, we're, we're fine. We're perfectly, we're perfectly okay with that. Okay, so what we do? So we just grab this uh, wrecking ball. So we just stand far back. And then we go and take the direct fire at it. Okay, so I shouldn't be missing that. Okay, so how does it work exactly? Oh, right, right, you know what? So, can we do... Can we do this? Oh, hold on, so there wasn't a... A, a racking ball attached to this a metal box. Okay, well, that's quite interesting.
Okay, hold on a minute. No, we're not doing that. Okay, I sincerely hope it hit the bullseye. Okay, so will it go through? Okay, well, this is kind of puzzleish. Okay, so we're going again. And can we use it? Can we use bomb flop for this? Let's let's go find out. So you bomb flop, what would happen? Oh, hold on, let's give it more extra juice. So we'll go give it extra juice if you need, and we'll go for recall. Alright, so would it go through? I mean, like, come on. Oh, hold on. So how about we do this? So can we take this box and then push it over to the target? I mean, we, we probably might see what's going to happen. Okay, hold on. So let's try attaching to it. Attach to it, please. Attach to it. Come on. Can you stick? Oh, oh I see. I see. And now what? So now we start swinging it? Oh, okay. I see what's going on now. Okay, so you need that big metal box to attach the other little wrecking ball in order to... To hit the other yeah, bullseye. Okay, so uh, that that seems to work perfectly. Now this gonna look kind of tricky in that in in that typical mechanic here because so we need to go right after that chest and it's not gonna be pretty easy. No, nope, no. Nope. Okay, well, not to panic. I mean that big metal boss can still come back. Okay, so we go and attach that. Okay, so that uh, piece of mechanic can move by itself. So why the heck is doing that? Okay, so let's get the recall. Okay, that didn't go pretty well. Alright, well at least we took the fallen. Alright, so uh, let's do this quicker. Okay, so let's try doing this instead. So we're going to, to build something up there and then we can start by paragliding to reach the chest. Alright, so we go open this. So we're able to get here. It's another large zone of charge. Alright, and I'm uh, moving back downwards. So we were supposed to, to unstick this. So we'll go and unstick all of this wood. And when we do that, so we'll probably go and swing this. So we'll go swing it to the other side. And we'll do get me a recall. Okay, so it, it wasn't supposed to move left and right. It was supposed to go straight through. So what is this puzzle we're looking at here? Okay, so it was put to go through. Okay, and then we start what? Okay, let's get to the call, see what happens. Um, hold on, where is it going? It better not be going the wrong way. Okay, I don't want it to the push to the uh, right. No. Go to the left, not the right. 
Oh, can we just swing it back and forth? Okay, so let's use the D-stick. Is it going to reach upward? This is having me confused. This looks hard. Are you kidding me right now? How are we supposed to solve this puzzle? Um, okay, give me one second. Okay, so we're gonna see how this is gonna work. So we had this the uh, stick stick to the um to the uh, contraction of that block piece. And now what? Yeah, we're pretty sure you need the racking ball to do that, and it's not pretty easy. Alright, one sec. Oh, wait! I think something just happened. Alright, well... <laughs> okay, well, that was lucky. I, I did not even see what just happened, but... It, it just happened. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. I'll, I'll, I'll let it slide. Alright, well, let's go examine, alright? So, we able to pick up one chest here in this whole shrine. And there we go. So, uh, we're about to get another light like, of blessing. And it felt to me because uh, we have not to see any goddess statue recently. So, we, we weren't supposed to keep an eye out for Vogue because uh, we wanted to keep on raising up some more hearts and more stamina. And yeah, so we're going to start off with our heart container first and then stamina. I mean... Um, I'm not entirely sure if they have a, a goddess statue somewhere around between the uh, Karat Forest. Okay, what are you talking about? We already saw this shrine. How can there be? How can there be another one? Okay, so one of these Karats can't talk about. So can this Karat talk? Well, none of these Karat can't talk. All right, well let's go tuck inside and see what's going on. Okay, so there was going to be a, a goddess statue right there. Right under our very noises. Okay, so uh, yeah, give me a sec. Okay, so, and we are done here. So, as you guys can see, so I'm able to blow out two of my stamina vessels and get in all of the, um, the heart containers I need. So, yeah, so I should have a, a lot of a hearts on me. So, uh, what's this, uh, jelly bean? What, what's that pillow that looks like a jelly bean? And whose house is this? Okay, I can't see who else it was. So, um, okay. So, what we got going on? So, there was going to be another another shrine. And it's somewhere beneath the chasm. So, what's this new discovery? So, this is the Deku Tree Chasm. Alright, so let's go beneath it. And let's go solve the mystery. So we're somewhere beneath here in the uh, Karat Groove. It's where we are. Okay, so what we got going on around here in every mechanic? Okay, well... This is quite odd. Okay, come on. Get off of me, you douche. Okay, come... What is going on here? Put me down! I, I can't fight in this clear battle. No, no. Throw something. Throw something. Don't see why I'm hitting the wrong button like that. So embarrassing. Okay, hold on. So we do need to defeat these guys first. Come on. Can you please let me throw something? Help me out, guys. Get them to stop touching me. Don't touch me. Please. Free these guys. They're all over the place. I mean, they can't stop. You got to be joking. This is frustrating. Can we take out one hand at a time, please? One hand at a time will be nice. If only I can just hit you with the fire fruit. Come on. 
This is stupid. Can you please, for once in your life, Okay, so uh, we, we do need to eat up. I'm starting to hate these things right now. Okay, so you know what? We need to start by fusing something. Something that we can start by fusing. You know what? We do need to fuse. If we die, then that's something I, I gotta blame on. So hold on. So uh, we do need to defeat for this. And uh, no, 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 hold on. So let's drop it first, and then select the weapon we want to choose, to go use. Okay, so, can you let me go? Guys, take them down! Okay, we're going again, let's start all over. Okay, so, I'm almost done you guys. I really don't like this fight with these um, hand looking Ganon things. Because they just can't. They, they just can't quit for nothing. And we got Phantom Ganon. Brilliant. So, no, I'm gonna go ahead and stick to using this weapon, which I'm still good at. So, bad news, you guys. So, I am able to defeat the, the yellow Chi Chi Jelly and the, the Gloom Sword did broke so easily. Which I can't go use anymore. But you know what? There's still the free for Reaper got enough agility on us. So we should probably go use that. Alright, so we'll go shield that. Alright, so we'll make sure we shield. Okay, and this sword broke. So I'm gonna go for another of this strong zone I shield. So come on, do your work. Okay, that's how you call it worst. Okay, so the black and crab is. It's almost done. Alright, so I gotta have a proportion AP. So let's not mess this up. Okay, so I do need more flurry rush. Thank you. I need that timing. Getting the flurry rush is not that easy. It takes practice and, and stealth timing. Okay, so uh, can you go again? Okay, so that's not how we flurry rush. I mean, it's halfway dead. Oh, come on. Just die, please. Just die. You're already dead. And it did jump another gloom sword. Which is a good thing. Okay, so now we knew where all of this chasm mess is coming from. Because that was a control by, by, Cal by Calamity Ganon. Okay, so everything looked pretty normal this time. Okay, and these corrupt fellas do want to speak to us. You did it. Thank you so much, Mr. Hero. The great Deku Trees are waiting for you in the corrupt forest. Alright, well, let's go and pick up everything. And we'll definitely be needing another Gloom Sword if we must. Okay, so let's not go and pick up everything here. So, um, yeah, so I do get myself another bow. And, yeah, so, um, sure, why not? I mean, we'll go ahead and check in with the, um, with the Deku Tree. So, uh, let's head on back to where we left off. So, somewhere around between. Let's, uh, go up to the surface. Okay, so it's a back to the shrine we pick off. And yeah, and I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so here we are. So we did res discover all of our hearts. So how in the world do we talk to this um this Deku tree exactly? So we go and talk to, so we just talk to this guy. Ooh, my head still's all fuzzy. Oh, your hand gone. What are you doing here? Oh oh yeah, now I remember it's all happened so suddenly. The great Deku Tree that was in agony and an uh, ominous fog it came out of his mouth. And then uh, a bunch of us at uh, Karate started acting funny. And then I knew monsters show up and, and I fought them all by myself and knocked them out one by, the, by one. 
I'm sorry I lied. I actually I couldn't move and I don't even remember what happened. It was all so sudden I don't know if any of the others remember either. Uh, but the thank to you, Mr. Hero, everybody is back to normal. Yay! I'm sure the great Deku or Tree wants to say thank you too. You should go. Um, yeah, I mean, we already met. Oh, you already met up? The great Deku Tree has been alive much longer than us at Karasa, so he's a kind of stoic and, and doesn't always show his feelings. But I'm sure that's that he's a thankful and uh, happy for what you did, and so am I. And I got a favor to ask. Some of the Karasa could use your help. Follow the light in their force. If you if you do, you'll come across a different Karasa who could have used your help. Please go find them and see what they need. Okay, so um, let's uh, make sure that we heal first. Now, do they have like a, a cooking pot that we can start cooking? Okay, so we got here more of this like, silent princess. And sure, why not? I mean, we can probably go and heal ourselves. Okay, we are taking took into a rough battle situation here. All right, so we'll go eat up everything. So we'll go eat up this apple and everything what's left here. Okay, so we got so many options here. Okay, so I don't want to go waste one of those. So we'll go eat one of these show shroom and get more heart fat. Look, I couldn't count how many hearts that we have. Left on us. Okay, well, I believe you got a lot of heart, which is a good thing because um, I'm all out of light of blessing, which I had to go and get some more because I had to go and beat more of these uh, shrine in order to get more. All right, well, that's gonna have to do it for today, you guys. So next time on the Let's Tales of the Tears of the Kingdom, we're gonna stick around and we uh, corrupt for it because we got it here. It's um a whole lot to see around here. And in every one of these uh, shooting mechanics around here, this Karat Forest. We'll go ahead and see where this uh, light leads to. And we'll go ahead and see what this uh, Karat wants for, for the, the side quest. And we'll go ahead and do more expedition on the next series, you guys. So you don't go anywhere and you will be particular and stay tuned on the next series. So thank you guys so much, so much for taking the time to tune in and watch this episode. So if you're enjoying the series and you want to see more of the Legends of the Tears of the Kingdom, be sure to leave an advertise a like, share the video, and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, ring the notification bell so that you'll be still up to notify to when we do some awesome videos up of the way. So that's going to be all it for the Legends of the Tears of the Kingdom. We will be picking more on the next one. So take care, guys. I hope to talk to you on the next video.